Nate McLeod up right now. Strasburg is on deck. He's thrown 96 pitches. Check swing. Umpire got hit. McLeod says he got hit. Marlins are going to appeal that that was a swing. Meanwhile, the health of home plate umpire DJ Rayburn is of concern. If McLeod swung at it, and Rayburn's in a, a great deal of pain right now, if McLeod swung at the pitch and it hit him, it's a strike. Let's look. It's off his leg. Here's the side swing look. Hey, boy, that's close. Yeah, that, it is. But it hits Rayburn pretty flush after it hits the leg of McLeod. Mm. That's a 50 50. Because of the circumstances, you wonder if the third base umpire, Brian O'Nora, he's watching his, his teammate, home plate umpire. Sean Cunningham, Marlins uh, trainer out there. Looked like it caught him flush right in the wrist. Yeah, he's flexing that uh, right hand. You know what? I don't think it hit. Go back there. Where does it hit McLeod? It never hits McLeod. I don't think it hits him. It doesn't hit McLeod. Yeah, McLeod's at first base. He he took off right away. He's. It doesn't hit him because you watch there. It doesn't change directions. Well, it would have been ball four, so it doesn't hit him. The, the question is, did he swing at it? I don't know if the Marlins have made that appeal yet. I think Saltalamakia might be waiting just to see if Rayburn is okay and then ask for oh, Nora, did he swing or not? Mike Redman watching from the step. And then if there is an injury to the home plate umpire, the umpires will have to switch, get somebody to get the gear on right away to go behind the plate. Umpires are tough. DJ Reynolds is saying just wrap it. Wrap it up. I'll finish this thing. Matt Williams the uh, Nationals manager comes out and he's visiting with one of the umpires right now. He doesn't look too happy. I'm trying to think what he would be unhappy about. Well he's always got his game face on so you never know. Yeah. I mean he's got a runner at first base. And that's it. There has been no motion from the umpires that there was any sort of appeal on the swing. He has to decide. By the way, Strasburg due up. Looks like he may, he may not. He's got to decide if he's going to use a pinch hitter. But yeah, it's just ball four. But did he swing? I say this all the time. So many times you see that call you, you either know what? way. They're actually calling McLeod back. There's two things they could be saying. Number one, they could say that he swung. Number two, they could say that he foul tipped it and that he has to come back and that the count would be three and two. Now, we just watched the video. It, it did not hit him, nor did it hit his bat. But the question that we had is did he swing at it? It doesn't hit him. You know, it's a 50 50 on whether he swung or not. It was three and one. But here's the question. Did he foul tip it? Because you're right, it doesn't hit him. But when Salta Lamacchia reaches to catch it, does the ball change directions? Because he doesn't catch it. That's why it caught a piece of DJ Raber in the home plate umpire. All right, let's listen to it, see if we hear something. There's a there's a tick in there. There's a tick in there before it gets the umpire. 
Hard to tell if the tick is the bat or the glove of Saul Tillamakia. Good point. So really a weird sequence and I don't think uh, 